Hey there everybody, this is Deegan from Deegan Network, and welcome to a special episode of Fire Emblem Gaiden. Um, this is pretty much just the, the grinding episode, uh, it's kind of like my advice on where to grind in Chapter 4, and the Lost Woods is a great place to grind, uh, as well as this spot, Dolk's Fort. Um, if you haven't seen that guide, or that episode, uh, go check it out, it will be features Pegasus Knights, you know, Est, Katria, and Paula. It's really beneficial for them. Definitely check that out. And we're going to go back to the Lost Woods. Okay. Now, if you don't know your way around the Lost Woods, that's okay. I also have a video on that. Uh, it's pretty much a walkthrough to show everybody where the uh, where all the loot is, where the angel statue is, the sage village entrance, the exit, and where the three mob locations are and that's what we're going to focus on today so let's go back to the start we're at the exit so it's two down one two okay so this is the uh, entrance now there's three mobs different types of mobs here and we're going to start with the least likely one uh, that i would use to grind so you go up one and left one now for these to respawn you have to exit the Lost Woods by the exit mark. Where I came in, that's where you have to exit, and you come back in, and then this will happen. If you use the teleporter, it will not work. So make sure you use the exit of the Lost Woods. All right. So these are the High Knights. Uh, they're they're stone completely. They're barons, and they're they're annoying. And here's why. They have a lot of power and a lot of defense and a decent magic defense. Of course, they can only move four. So just be careful. The way I would set this up, since they can only move four, I would use the first turn to go ahead and uh, set up your units. This is a great leveling location for uh, melee or casters, and I will not be using my Pegasus Knights because they're already level 20 and I will not get any experience for that, so there's no purpose. Okay, so we count one, two, three, four. Okay, so we make sure we don't have any anyone there. Go right here. Kimberly is gonna go right there, and I'm gonna stick Balbo right here. Two, three, four. Now they should attack, but I'm already setting this up for the next turn, so don't worry about that. That was perfect. Like I said, they take a lot of damage, so be careful. Uh, they attacked Saber twice. Saber took 20 ki uh, 20 damage points, and that's okay because we have Jenny that can heal. And Jenny's already level 15, and I've only been through here twice, and she leveled up uh, from level nine. She leveled six times in here with six encounters. That's pretty impressive. Okay, so we're gonna stick Celica here. Go ahead and do. Oh, wait, hold on. Hold on just a second. 30. 30 points. Let's go ahead and weaken that just a little bit more. Valvo. I'm gonna concentrate on my casters, because that's kinda what I'm doing right now. And Valvo's level 5. Uh, I'm focusing on Celica. That's primarily why. But you can. You know, go ahead and attack with your casters first, and then finish off with your uh, your melee units. I'm just gonna use Ragnarok because I like that move. 27 damage, awesome, and you get 40 experience, so it's it's pretty cool. Uh, next, let's see May. I want May to go here. I'm just gonna go ahead and lighten this dude. Should have lightened the other guy. That's okay. Okay, so he has full health. So we're gonna have Leo attack him, get him down 12. Like I said, I've already done this uh, once. <clears throat> once or twice, so I kinda already know the numbers. Attack. Cool. Don't care. And Saber's gonna finish and he's gonna level up. Cool. Saber's level 8. Cool, 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 cool. Alright, so that's the first one, and 
just remember this is the one right by the Silver Lance. Okay, so we're gonna go back, and now we're gonna go back to the start. So back one left, or back one right, and then down one to the start. And this is the not the exit, but the start. Remember that. So next we're gonna go down one, and you can go left. Now this is the second option. If I, I also would not recommend this one because it could kind of suck. Because I'm training Celica, therefore it doesn't really benefit me a whole lot to attack wizards. Because um, they have magic resistance. Not to mention, I don't like the positioning of uh, these guys. So I'm just going to go ahead and attack them. Uh, it really doesn't matter. I don't have a formation or anything. Because it doesn't really matter. Now, just be careful with Valvo. He uh, doesn't have magic defense. So... I wouldn't use him for this battle. You can if you want to. You always have Jenny to heal. And that wizard, this one, he likes to go over there in the trees. So, we're gonna go over here, steal his spot, and we're gonna get rid of this guy. Awesome. Now we have a few more people here. Lightning. Fortunately, that didn't help. I'm gonna do Nosferatu because uh, they're all gonna attack Silk anyway. Fortunately. Okay, let's see what we got here. And he's gonna, she's gonna use uh, Nosferatu or Angel, one of those two. Oh no. Oh, Baba doesn't really take that much damage. Okay. That was fine. That was actually really awesome. Boom! 1 KO. Gone. Next. You are saver. Next. Ragnarok. Done. Angel, done. You get 24 points. You get 24 points per wizard. It could be different for you depending on your level. If you're under level, you will gain a lot more. So that's awesome. Like May only got 16. That's okay. Uh, you go left again, and that's the uh, silver, silver bow. Okay, so we're going to go back, uh, right to the chest, so right one from the wizard, and remember, up one is a start. So you're going to go down one more again, and one more again. And now this is the area that I would definitely consider grinding all the way, and that's because the mobs are mummies. They are pre-promoted, well not pre-promoted, but they are promoted versions of zombies. They literally still suck. They have no stats whatsoever, but they give a lot of experience because they're a promoted unit. And they're weak, so you can just send Celica up there if you want. But I recommend um, just go ahead and send a variety of units out there, whoever you want to do. Look at that, she got 52 experience from that. The High Knights only gave 40, but these guys gave 52. Definitely go here. This is an awesome spot. This is almost... I think this might be better than uh, Dragon Zombies at the Dragon Temple, but it's definitely not as good as uh, Dolk's Fort. But that was limited to the the Pegasus Knights because of the Swamp, and also Dragon Zombies will destroy Celica. I mean, she can't tank seven or eight dragons at once, so this is definitely the way to go. Experience. Cool. Level up. Fortunately, they all want to attack Jenny. So I would just go ahead and get Jenny all the way up to uh, 20. She's level 18 already. It's not going to take her that long. Nice. 52 more experience. And I want to give Silva this kill. Back. Hold on. 
dead. Oh, almost dead. Fifteen. Like I said, they level quick here. Boom. Critical hit. Forty-two points. Done. Okay, and also one left. This is the uh, silver sword. Go back, and then that's uh, left one, and then up three at the start, and then you go up two, and then uh, right one, up one is a sage village, which I'll just show you real quick, right there. Um, it's this way. Inner Lost Woods, yes. Go ahead and enter that. Save the game. Continue playing, yes. We're gonna go back. Now we're gonna test this out to see if the uh, mummy's still there. Oops. Three, and then one. And they are! This is awesome. Okay, so let's send May up. Happens, that's too bad. And uh, these guys are not going to participate. Attack May. Well, May has a holy sword, which is awesome too. When you promote May after she reaches level 20, which is a long path, she becomes a Celica pretty much. She's able to use swords uh, without Ragnarok. So, that's pretty awesome. Nice, level 13. And with a holy sword that Celica is using in chapter 2, she'll destroy mummies in half. Alright. So that didn't really help my cause a whole lot. So Jenny's already level 20. Done. She will probably not gain any more experience. Let's check that out. Nosferatu. She should gain 1 XP? Nope, no XP. Maxed out. Awesome. Sad because Celica only has a 25 HP point. Or 27 HP point. No HP. God, no freaking HP. That's fine. Doesn't matter. I dead. Yay, level 16. Now we're gonna do that again. Again and again and again until everyone's like level 20. That's an excellent way to grind. I may even grind all my characters up to level 20 this way. I mean, it's freaking awesome. Oops. There was one more up. No, it wasn't. I think I went up too far. Nope, this is the high knight. God damn it. I was not looking forward to this one. My least favorite one. So this one I actually have to try. You know what? I don't give a shit. It's like 40 XP per care less. Alright, that guy's fucked. Paula still sucks a dick. But she shouldn't. Because she's level 20. Alright, meaning I need to go up one and to the left. 
Perfect. Yes. Back. Down one. Uh, down two. Last words. Three, four, five. And then to the left. Let me. Or right. Sorry. Oh, okay. Work. Okay, that's fine. Okay. We're not going to be participating. We will not participate. Fuck off. And last episode. Now, I'm not going to get all my units up to 20 this way. Probably not. I'm not sure yet. May. It depends. I'm very much thinking about it. I want Celica to get to 20 though. I should be doing this one at a time so I can uh, give everybody their angel ring. But they're all good thus far. Oh. You could be promoted to villager. Yeah, why would I want to do that? Well, that's because you can promote him to villager and then promote him to, uh. He's a Dragon Knight or Draco Knight or some shit. Uh, I think. I just think Slayer's better. Oh, it's, what's going on here? Seventeen. Dead. Level fifteen. Yay. Well, you get the general idea. Uh, I hope this video has been some help to you guys. Um, and if not, well, I don't need to know. <laughs> Just uh, keep those kinds of comments to yourself, and uh, everybody will be happy. Hey, come on. Up one. Okay, so it's right here. Yes. Oh, what's going on? Baba. Okay, now my power is above a thousand. That's cool. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please uh, send me an email at the uh, YouTube or post a comment and uh, I will get back to you. Alright, thanks. See you later.